Hello everybody, so in today's video I'm gonna show you how to export Minecraft Bedrock Worlds from your Android device to another device, such as a computer for example. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go to your Minecraft application and you simply want to do this to check out the worlds you have and to enable external mode. So here we can go on play and we have one world and this is the world we want to export. Okay. So once we check this out, all you want to do is go to settings and then you want to scroll down to the bottom until you find storage. Right? So you want to scroll down, click storage. You want to find application here on the top. Simply click external. Okay. You now have activated external mode on your Minecraft application. So all you want to do here is simply go back to your home screen and you now want to go to your app store to download a file explorer. So there's many of these, but we will just be using the archiver. It's nice and simple. So the archiver, like so. And there's this app here. I will have this app linked in the description if you want it, but all you need to do here is simply click install, like so. And once you have the archiver, you can simply open up the app and it will ask you to give it permission to read files, of course. So simply click OK, enable it, and go back. It might ask you for a notification. You can do allow or don't allow. I'll just do don't allow. And you have a little tutorial here. And just do OK. And once you're here, you simply want to go on your Android folder here. And once you clicked Android, you want to go on data. Now you want to scroll down until you find Minecraft. Here it is, com.mojang.minecraft.pe. And here we just give you a little warning because it is an internal file, so just okay. And depending on what Android version you have, you might have to give it permission. You can do this by just clicking use this folder here and allow. You can now access the files folder. So all you want to do is click files, games, com.mojang, and you now want to find your Minecraft world. So here it is. And here we'll have all the list of Minecraft worlds you have. Now, I've only had one of them, it's right here. And all you want to do is simply long press it, and you want to click copy. Then you want to go to your downloads folder here on the left, and you want to paste. Now the reason for this, it is just to bring it to a easier to understand area. And if you're going to be using your computer to explore it, it will be easier as well. So once you have this sorted out, all you want to do is go to your folder here. So click that. And once you're here, all you want to do is click the check check icon here. You just want to select multiple folders and files like so. There you go. And once you have this sorted out, all you want to do is zip it. So you want to long press, compress, and here you have a bunch of things, but you want to change uh, archive format to zip. And once you have this order out, you can just do okay. And we now have zipped our world, it's right here. So what you want to do here is long press again, copy, downloads, paste. Now what you want to do is simply long press again, Rename, change.zip to MC world, like so. And once you have renamed it, make sure there's no space. But once you have renamed it, so it is exactly dot MC world, no space anywhere, just do done and OK. Now what you can do is go to your other device or share this file around, and people will be able to import your world. So now what we want to do is simply go to our computer and you simply want to plug in your phone. And once you do this, you can go to your computer. So here on the computer and you can go to your file explorer. You can go to this PC and find your phone. Once you have your phone, simply go on internal shared storage or internal storage. Downloads, as you can see, it's nice and easy to get. And we have our MC world here. So simply copy it go to downloads and paste it. Now, once we have this, what we can do is simply double click it and it's gonna open up Minecraft Bedrock, world import started. 
and world import finished successfully. So what we can do here is simply go on play, phone, and we should be able to be in our world. So yeah, like so. So now we are currently in our world and yeah, it is that easy to export a world on your mobile device. So if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one. Bye.